It's actually the reason you can hear static in all the fucking videos. This headset is shite. So, in about a week's time, I'm going to be ordering a new head, well, microphone. And hopefully that will fucking stop all this static shit. I'm going to throw the PS4 out the fucking window, because, you know, fuck the PS4. Right. Episode 5, I believe. I'm pretty sure it's episode 5. Since I'm pissed off, I'm going to go and kill some cunts. I spent the night, I was supposed to start streaming an hour and 30 minutes ago. But because this headset's a cunt, and I thought it was actually the PlayStation, I moved everything around to make sure that it was. Well, it wasn't the. PS bang on fucking start the stream on my uh, laptop and I forgot to turn the fucking thing down again which is a piss take but as I was saying I thought it was my PS4 that was making the fucking noise moved that really far away then I thought it was the speakers that are plugged into my telly that it was causing the static and that wasn't it either because I unplugged them and turned them off and so I went into the microphone sensitivity setting and literally making no noise whatsoever put the headset as far away from the PlayStation and everything else I could and it was quite literally the fact that the microphone was picking up sound from the actual speaker part of the headphones which were pissing me off and causing the static. So. I'm a little angry. I spent an hour and a half trying to fucking sort the problem out. The problem is this fucking headset, so this headset is going in the bin as soon as I can get a new one. Or at least some sort of microphone to record. Something simple like the Blue Yeti or the Blue Snowball, whatever the fuck that one's called. And hopefully that will sort the shit out. If not, I'm going to be a little annoyed. Again. I'm going to raid every fucking car here, every fucking building here, and I'm going to look for something to kill. Because spending an hour and a half trying to sort out a fucking problem with static is a piss take. Alright. Episode 5. Now I've calmed down a little bit and had a run. Let's break in here and fucking steal everything because no one else needs this shit. It's mine. If you can hear my brother laughing, he's in the other room. I have no clue what he's doing, but he's a really loud laugher. Thank fuck! Something to kill! Come here, you cunt. Get fucked. Take my fucking anger on you. Yeah, bitch. That's what I fucking thought. Now, what else have we got in here to rob? Cash register. Rob. Nothing in there. Uh, pff, nothing brilliant. Anything out here? There's got to be something hidden in there. Fucking hell. I'm guessing that's outside. Break me here. Let's see what they've got. Hopefully, it'll be something useful. Get rid of the fucking wood. Come on. Okay. So, even though there was literally no wood there, it was still sounding like I was cutting logs. And the gun's are brilliant. I don't know if our pick's going to even be fun. I have enough of your ability to get through this. Hopefully it will, because, well, I'm a little pissed off, and I need something to go right today, because everything is going fucking wild. So, hopefully, we can get some, at least one gun blueprint, because then we can work our way to getting that gun and all. Almost there now. Ooh. 
I wonder how much damage a pickaxe can do to a zombie. That would be a very interesting test. Probably fucking. Let's have a fucking look to see if it would actually do any damage. Um, oh, I didn't realize. We still have that one. 3.98 damage. Yeah, no, it does less damage than the fucking club that we have. Thank you. We have a hunting rifle barrel and a hunting rifle receiver. Ugh, better than nothing, I guess. Upstairs now. Oh, the cooking pot. I fucking missed it completely. Nothing. Stuff. Bit of iron. Weird thing to have in an oven. Well, we've got loads of water bottles now. We need to find a source of water to fill them up, because otherwise we're going to run out of water. Oh, hello. Okay, there's a whole massive hole in the building. Don't know what the fuck that other thing was I just picked up. What was it? Oh, blood draw kit. Never used one of them before, probably won't use it, but, you know. Right, bin. Nothing. Blueprints, please. A rocket one just came out. Nice. Right. Learn that. Uh, that'll be fine. Um, upstairs. Well, the ladder. I'll fucking get up. Nice. You clearly didn't do well defending yourself. A seed and a bit of wood. Right. Back down the stairs and out the front of the fucking door. I don't think we're actually going to have enough space to rob all these houses. But all the cars are getting robbed. But they're not even houses, they're fucking shops. Hmm. Uh, paper again. More paper. We have nothing. You're a brilliant car, you know that. Right. Last one. Again, nothing. Right, box. Actually, is there anything in that car? Oh. Probably not. I would like a horde of zombies to just randomly appear so I can murder the fuck out of them. Right, I'm home now to deposit all this shit. Hopefully we'll find a stag or something on the way back, because I want to get that quest done. But I'm also hoping that the static sound is a little bit quieter, because I've actually pulled the mic a little bit further away from the headset. Even though I w it kind of wouldn't do... Oh, Yes. I fucking missed! Oh my god, do you know what? This is fucking going worse than yesterday. How? The fuck? Thank you. Chase the fucking bastard. Die already! I'm probably gonna have to hit it again. There's a pig over there. Oh, come on! Fuck off, zombie. I'm not in the mood for you right now. I want this stag dead. Come here, you fucking leapy little bastard. I hit you already. Bleed out. Bleed out, you prick.
How fucking far is this little prick gonna go? Okay, quietly. Let's see if we can sneak up on the bastard. Where the fuck has he gone? Gotcha, you little prick. Well, I'm bleed out. Come on. Where'd the prick go? He's down there. Fucking missed it. Brilliant. You can fuck off and all, you prick. <coughs> fucking think you're gonna kill me. Prick. Right. What do we need for the arrows? We need some stuff, for fuck's sake. Wait, we've got iron arrowheads, don't we? I've got one, but we've also got two iron arrows. Let us make, hopefully, in your arrow venue, and then slide it over. Oh, that lag. How can I miss? Got it. Thank fuck. Right. Get here. Fucking get cut off, you prick. I really don't care that I'm being smelt. So stop telling me. The zombies want to come fucking bashed over general and all. Right, home. I need to start setting up some more defences for the house. There's another fucking airdrop even though they're set to a, set to a fucking week, which is pissing me off. All the same, just keep changing. It's driving me fucking insane. Bit of stone, we'll make some more fucking arrows. We'll have to scrap this pickaxe once we've fucking broken it, because this one is fucking shut. Come on, give me all the stone. Oh, I'm just getting iron out of this. Nice. I was done with this fucking ages ago. If there is a zombie near me, you can fucking wait. You rude, arrogant prick. How far away is that? Oh, it doesn't even matter at all. Right, let us go here. Oh, fucking no wonder we were only getting iron. I haven't got any fucking space for this stuff. Fucking mean, bitch. Fuck you. Come on, man. Give me the eggs back. Got another quest to do after we've done this one. Uh, home's this way. Yeah, I see you up there, you prick. You're getting it. Um, fuck the cotton. I want the arrowhead. Oh no, it's a fucking tree stump. I thought it was a zombie. And it's empty. Right. 
we need to clear out some of this fiber or the grass patches and get some more defenses set up for the seventh day. Okay, let's dump all of this shit for a minute. Apart from they can just go in there. You can have that back down there. Eggs uh the meat can go in there for a minute. Keep hold of the wood. I don't know where we got the gas from, but fuck it, why not? Bullets, water, that, 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 what that. Fuck it, every single last piece apart from that fucking bandage on that back. Right, let's go and get some fucking stone while we're at it. We need some more fucking arrows because I'm a really fucking bad shot. Only when recording, it seems. Hopefully, we can get a fuckload of stone. We can fucking sort out this. We need a fuckload more wood. And we need to make like 200 wooden spikes. I guarantee 100 ain't gonna be enough to go around the house. Or if it is, then we're probably going to want two layers of fucking spikes just to make sure. Our oh, stream's not too far behind, to be fair. It's like ten seconds or so. And thankfully, the cup of tea that I accidentally knocked over while getting fucking going mental because of this headset, it fell on my laptop and caused a little bit of water damage on the screen, but it seems to be drying itself up. Well, I wouldn't say water damage, it was just the, the screen slightly wet. That pig! Come here, you prick. No, come here. Little prick. Hey, little piggy piggy. Please tell me I didn't leave them. Oh, for fuck's sake, out of stamina. Are you fucking kidding me? Come on, we can make this shot. No, we fucking can't. And now the pig's gonna get away. Oh, nothing is going right today, for fuck's sake. Come here, you little bastard. Ooh. There's another fucking stag and all, and we have no fucking arrows. Come here, you little prick. Probably make some arrows, but then we'd lose the pig. Oh, you little fuck. That's it. Arrows, where are you? Oh, I put the fucking feathers away. Brilliant. Where'd that fucking pig go? Come here, little piggy. Get stuck on something, please. Please get stuck on something, you little prick. Look, now you're on fire. What the fuck? Just die already? And he's not dead. Come back, you little prick. How many hits is this bastard gonna take? He's on fire again. Come on, die. Oh, thank God. Yes, we did enough of this. Well, that should be cooking while it's on fire, to be honest. Come on, there's a fucking dozy zombie behind me somewhere. Alright, that'll do. Get back to the house. No, oh, am I on? No. Yes, I'm on fire. Fucking brilliant. 
Thankfully the fire's gone out. Please be some feathers. Yes. No, that one. Thank you. Arrow, please. Bird's nest. Uh the sound sensitive just down a bit. Any more bird's nest? There's one there. Brilliant. Oh, one bird. Fuck it, today's challenge, uh, today's task is fucking hunting. Oh! That makes up for everything! Fucking A! Headshot, bitch! How do you like them apples? Makes up for all those fucking shitty shots of that. Hopefully, with all this uh, hide that we're getting today, we can uh, make ourselves a second forge for the house that we're going to be building at some point. And that we'll be mining this just in case. Oh, it's not trick pad that we can use this later on. I can't remember what fucking for, but my oh god, we'll fucking use it. Right, let's get back. How much wood have we got? Wow, really? Only 100? I can hear you, zombie. Where the fuck are you? Hello? Okay, that was weird. I think we've been in this house. Well, maybe not. Fuck it. Scavenging and hunting was today. We've got two out of the five fucking stags already. Right. Give me the fucking candle. Give me that fucking bed. And that's fucking everything. Oh, there you are. Oh, yes. I'm getting better at this game already. Two headshots in a row. Now that is impressive. Let's see if we can get this cunt. If we can pull off a headshot with him. Three in a row! Okay, now I'm happy. That makes up for all the shitty shots, and that actually cheered me up a bit. I'm not as angry now. All right, let's get home and do some building. Get some wood first. I don't actually know how much wood we've got back in the house, but we need some. Hopefully we can make ourselves... Actually, do you know what? Fuck it. Let's go home and make ourselves a fire axe. Cut down these trees faster. Uh. Well, now I'm a little bit calmer. I'll explain the whole mic situation a little bit better. Uh, the headset I'm using is shit. It's picking up static from the headphone, like the actual speakers inside the noise cancelling, like buds and it's causing static in the videos so they won't be around much longer one more week probably eight days because in a week I'll order the microphone that I'm going to be getting and then I think it's a one day delivery so it's not too bad put that in there um Nice, we've got quite a few arrows. Excuse me for that fucking weird whatever the fuck that was. Right, let's make some more fucking arrows. Make another iron. iron. Do we? No, we're safe there actually. Is it all this? The stone. Actually, no, wait. That's down there. 
Right, let's take all of this down. Let's make a fuck ton of arrows. Four minutes to craft all of them. Brilliant. Put the stone back. Uh, put the bandage down there. Moldy bread. We can use that for antibiotics, I believe. There's one way to find out. Oh, brilliant. Right, let's put it in our inventory. Mm. Eat at your own risk can be used to craft antibiotics at a campfire with a beaker. Nice. Let's go and see what we need to make that. Because that, if we can get a nice supply of uh, mouldy bread, then we might be able to make antibiotics quite easily. Oh, there we go. There's a use for our nitrate powder. Antibiotics uh, is made with one mouldy bread, one nitrate powder, and all of our meat is grilled. We will stick that in there. Right. Nope, that menu. Okay, food and water is not too bad. Right, also we're going to add to this building list. Um, oh yeah, we we're going to... Wrong one! We want some... Ford time. How much can we make? Fifteen. Fuck it, do it. And while we wait for that to cook, let's go and harvest some wood with this shitty hatchet. Get the fuck out of there. Oh, no. No. Oh, for fuck's sake. I'm not dying again. Fuck that. Oh, my God. one of them. And that was a major fuck up. Right. Keep that there. Jesus Christ. Right. We're getting rid of some of these. It's almost 7.30. So we still have quite a little amount of time before night time. I get some wood, make some defences, and hopefully clear out some of this grass so we can put sand some spikes today at least. Circle around the tree just to make sure we're not going to from behind. Brilliant, that's fucked. Let's go make our fire axe. Fuck that tree stump. Carefully does it. I swear to god if I stab myself with my own fucking spikes again I'm gonna be a little pissed. Right. Iron fire axe craft. That's gonna take a little while. What the fuck am I carrying that for? Go away. Right, get in there. You can wait down there. Some of that. Now we've got a bit of wood. Let us make. Oh no, it's no, that one. There we are. 85 Okay, it's now 8 o'clock We need a lot more wood Let's see how many trees we can put down So much quicker So much easier be even better when we get the steel one on it. 
because then we can fucking prepare food and so on. And I think you get a better bonus when you use steel tools rather than iron ones. I don't think you get any bonus whatsoever if you use normal like stone tools. So you definitely get bonuses. Oh, I just got a bonus of 200 wood from that one tree. You'll see it down at the bottom right. As soon as the tree gets to zero, you get a bonus of plus so and so. And bonus of 100. That zombie. Fucking isn't it? Get off my land! Oh, that was fucking shit. What? Thank you. Goggles. Now we can look like a fucking old fashioned air pilot. Oh, me off if I can hit the tree. Right, so we're having a couple of those zombies wander towards our house already, so we definitely need to get the fucking place defended. At least a little bit. Now we got a bonus of 200 from that tree. Egg. Right, this will do for now for wood. Let us get that out of my fucking hot dog in a minute. more of this. Oh, I just realised we ha I don't think we've learnt the floor hammer thingy yet. Blueprint so we can we have to uh, make another stone hatchet so that we can build. Otherwise we're not gonna be able to build fucking anything. Oh I've not noticed that one there before. Hopefully they'll, uh, I don't know if they've already added in something to collect this shit easier and like, fucking faster, but I hope they do at some point. I don't even care if it's a fucking lawnmower, I'll fucking use that. Or some sort of attachment to a mini bike, but like a mini, uh, a lawnmower attachment. It'd be fucking nice. It'd be so much easier to get this stuff, just drive around and fucking run it over. Rather than sitting, punching, fucking, ever. Getting only fucking two per fucking hit. Right. We need 15 more seconds until night time. At which point we should be in the house, so to avoid being chased. The zombies can run at night time. If I haven't already fucking said that, which I probably have. Alright, let's get in here carefully. Nice. Didn't stab myself that time. Close that. Um. Oh, we can put those goggles on. Right, we got 1,566 wood during that little tree chopping spree. Uh, dump the feathers in there for a minute. Egg can go in there. Uh, what was I doing? I was making myself an axe, so I need some stone. That was what I was looking for. I need. Two, I think, but I'm gonna get three out just in case. Yep, two. Dump that. Put that there for a minute. Okay, that needs to go off. I think my stepmom is singing. Hopefully you can't hear that. I apologise if you can hear her. 
But um, I want to do a, a quick shout out to my stepbrother, Ryan. He's 11 now, I think. Probably the worst stepbrother in the world for not knowing his age, but uh, he watches all these videos through and he's been trying to help me figure out what the fuck the static noise was. And it just turns out that it's actually the microphone on this headset because I plugged in the little headphone uh, mic that come with the actual PS4 and I was getting no static whatsoever from that. It's literally just this headset. Which is why it's getting fucking replaced as soon as possible. After this video I might actually look around to see if I can find another headset that will actually work with the PS4. Just to use that until I can get the fucking either the Blue Snowball or the Blue Yeti. I haven't decided which one I want yet, but I think we'll go with the Snowball for now, and if that one's not any good, then later down, later on down the line I'll get a different one. Although there's quite a f few good reviews for the uh, yet, uh, Snowball. Although a lot of people seem to prefer the Yeti. I don't know if that's because it's a better quality or anything. All I know is it's like twice the price of the Snowball. So we'll go for the Snowball for now. Unless I find something better. But we'll go for the Snowball now. And if that's no good, as I said, then we'll go for the Yeti down, later down the line. Maybe something a bit more... I don't know if cost is to do with the quality of the uh, microphones or if it's just something to do with the, the company that sells it, but I'm assuming it's probably the quality, although a lot of companies nowadays will sell you something for a really high price and it will last five minutes, aka Apple. The only iPhone that I've ever owned, well I've owned two, but the only iPhone that I've ever owned that hasn't broken was my iPhone 5. Uh, my iPhone 4 decided to pack up on me. Uh, everyone that I know, that are like friends and that, that's ever had an iPhone 6 seems to have problems. Uh, iPhone 4s have a lot of problems. Obviously. I don't think Apple pays any attention to what people actually want. Not being rude or anything, but... Well, the iPhone 7? What the fuck was going through their head when they thought, Oh, let's take away the uh, headphone jack. And not tell anyone until we fucking hand it out, and then they're like... So, how the fuck do I listen to music through headphones? And then, if they didn't get the headphones with the actual iPhone, the Bluetooth ones that they're selling now. They're like a hundred and something pounds. Which is fucking retarded. Considering Bluetooth anything is really bad for pretty much everyone, believe it or not. For men it can make you go sterile if you have it near your genitals too often. So obviously if your phone is in your pocket and the Bluetooth's on Without knowing, you're actually sterilizing yourself. I have no clue how that works. All I know is it fucking affects you because I learned that in science probably like five or six years ago. But I have no clue if everyone's science lessons actually state all of this, but just in case not. If you're a bloke, Keep it away. Keep your Bluetooth stuff away from your pockets. Keep it up high. Like, if you've got a jacket that has a pocket on, like your chest, put it there because it's further away from your genitals. You got the last chance of sterilising yourself then. Also, a lot of people won't know, but the PS4 controller is actually Bluetooth as well. So keep that away from your app. We're just doing a bit of mining while we, this uh, night time goes past. I know I've been fairly angry during this video and I'm sorry, I tried to calm myself down before I actually come on here, but it was already an hour and a half late so I thought I'm going to have to fucking go on no matter what because I was supposed to stream this at 4 o'clock and 
it was already about half past five before I started. And I really didn't want to let down my only four subscribers at the moment. On YouTube, that is. I have no followers on Twitch. But occasionally I'll get one or two people jump in. I'm assuming the only person watching is probably me. Because I have the stream open so I can actually make sure that it's actually working. And... Well, since I was angry today, you can probably tell that I've been a lot more confident in my speaking because I was just fucking angry and I needed to rant. So, um, yeah. I'm, I apologise for being angry, but obviously there's a lot of things going on with me at the moment and I don't really want to explain anything more than the fact of what I've already told you with my depression and all of that. Anyone with depression will understand just what I mean sort of thing. I mean I have other problems as well which I'm not going to state because obviously that's personal. Depression is just it's just an open thing with everyone because I don't want to come across some days that I'm really confident and other days that I'm just fucking miserable as fuck so I don't really want to talk as much. But it seems I want to get fucking angry and I could talk as long as I want which isn't a problem really. So this was day s five. We are in day six this morning at the moment. But um, today we've killed two stags, a pig that, well, the pig killed itself, but we tried to kill the pig. We got four headshots, three in a row, and then one I missed two shots and then hit that twat in the face. But, um, yeah, we've done, well, I almost killed myself again as well. Uh, what else have we done? We've uh, raided the little town place again. We've got another one of those buildings. Uh, we got through all of the cars, which was hopefully good. I'll have to rearrange all the chests at some point in a minute. Um, tomorrow, we are going to start working on the defences for around the house, ready for day seven. Which, hopefully, if we're lucky, we can dodge a bullet and hopefully the blood moon won't arise and we'll be fine. Because occasionally, people don't know, but occasionally it doesn't actually come. I mean, you'll, you'll see a couple of zombies, but you'll know on day seven if it is actually a blood moon. Or on a mo or Obviously, every seven days you get the horde. But um, on, on the seventh day of like each week, so we'll say we start the week as Monday, that's day one. Then that implies that Sunday is the blood moon, which is the seventh day or the 14th day or the 21st day or the 28th and so on. Um, you'll know if it's a blood moon because if you can just look outside, look at the sky, if you look at the moon it will be glowing red. I know a lot of people will actually know that, but obviously some people wouldn't because they may not have played the game, or even if they had to play the game, they may not know that, because they may not be outside on any of the seventh days, so they wouldn't have seen the moon, but that is a sign that it's a blood moon, and obviously you want to stay inside on like at night time after 10 o'clock or whatever time you've got it set to, because as soon as it turns night time on your game, the zombies can and will run which makes it a lot harder to get away from them because I'm pretty sure they don't run out of stamina but obviously you will I mean I'm just sat here mining this stone and I've got in stamina constantly have we leveled up? yeah can we get yes, yes we can fucking A yeah, we got six points. Is there only five point ones we can unlock? No, not at the moment. That's oh, fine. Now we can mine a bit quicker. Um, if I, I can't remember if I've explained the minus sixty nine er to anyone in past videos. I probably have, but it, every time you level that up, you get a twenty percent damage bonus to any blocks that you damage so obviously mining will be quicker cutting trees will be quicker digging dirt will be quicker like digging clay will be quicker uh, you got 
the taking down your defenses quicker, hopefully. I don't actually know if that one's true. But um, it seems to be quicker anyway for the defenses in my experience. Um, but yeah, I've had a little rant today, and I'm sorry for anyone that didn't really want to fucking listen to it. But I needed it to get it off my chest and out of the fucking way so I didn't have to worry about it. I've been getting this weird fucking stomach. Just like, I don't know when uh, people get the weird um, throwing up in your mouth sort of thing, but it doesn't quite come up, so it's more like a small hiccup. I've been getting them today and they're fucking horrible. But um, we will start off tomorrow with um, cutting down some more wood, getting some more wooden spikes probably, we were going to want an iron shovel because that would be so much easier to dig the dirt because we're going to make a trench at some point. Can we even scrap this? No. Okay, in that case, we'll just fucking use it up. Um, is there anything else in here we need? How many nails have we got? Which we could do with making a big storage box. I don't think it's bigger, it just looks bigger and it's labelled, so. We've got two, so I think we need eight more. Let's see if we can get one of them storage boxes. Uh, there. Because I can't be fucked to click that thing up and down. We'll just label that. There we go. Now if we go in here, um, is it under... Probably this one. There's my other stepbrother, he's the annoying one. If you can hear him, that is. Is it in here? Fuck it, do you know what? It'd be quicker if we just do this. Here we go, these are the ones that you got your big storage box for your ammo, building supplies, explosives, food, health, weapons, and if you don't want to make them ones, you can just make the small ones, which is this one here, which is only wood and maybe a bit of fibre? Nope, just wood. Ten wood, and you make one of them chests, and there is that much space in there. There's a in there for now, because we don't actually need them right now. Um... Is there any clay in here? No, so we also need clay tomorrow. Let's dump this in here for now. Take that. And let us make some more wooden spikes. Eventually we'll, we'll be getting these ones, but they're 30 wood each one. But you can upgrade them. But these ones are basic wooden spikes. And they just fucking help so much for when you're starting off. We can, oh Jesus, we don't want 458. Okay, we've got 85, so that's 115 more. If I'm correct. Which ain't too bad. Right, what else can we make in here already? Okay, we have... Probably, well, we could build some wood for them, but we don't really want that. We can make a rocket casing, which is quite fucking expensive. Uh, we need to learn some metal at some point. Also, we need to learn the forged steel. It'd be nice to get some of this better stuff. Just to, we can make glass jars in here. I didn't realise that. One clay and ten pieces of broken glass. Not bad. And you can get broken glass just by uh, when you. Sometimes when you mine, you pick up sand. Uh, you, you get it more often when you're mining underground with your pickaxe, and then you'll get like a random block that is like dirt, but it's not it's sand. And then you pick up sand. If you put that in the forge and let it cook up, you'll get glass in there, which ain't too bad. And my father's whistling. What? Yeah. Quickly have to talk to my dad then. 
he just popped in to check to see if I was alright. Uh, for anyone wondering, uh, yes, I am a 20 year old that lives with my father. Uh, due to my medical issues, I need someone around at all times just to keep an eye on me for now at least until the medical help comes through. And then I will be getting on with my life. And I was correct with that uh, calculation of the 115, so my maths is working today, which is something. Alright, dump the wood in there. Actually, we'll just dump the fences in there. It is now daytime, so today's episode is now over. Hopefully, we'll get some more subscribers at some point, but until then, like and favourite, and we will see you in the next episode. Adios.